How to have a puja at home. Hindus offer a puja or worship ceremony every day in the home, typically early in the morning. There's no set program to follow and rites can be as simple or as elaborate as you'd like. You will need a home shrine with murti or images and icons of a deity or deities, small brass and or silver pots, a large metal tray, ghee or clarified butter for lighting the lamps, a standing oil lamp, small lamps with cotton wicks, a deep tray, incense sticks, an incense burner or matchstick, scripture, sacraments and offerings from your tradition, a hymn recorded or live, and bells. Step 1. Avoid consuming food for at least an hour before the puja. Step 2. Prepare items for the puja, which can vary depending on the deities worshipped and individual choice. These can include sacred water or milk, uncooked rice mixed with turmeric, fresh stemless blooms or loose flower petals, and sacraments of one's tradition such as red powder, sandalwood paste, or holy ash. Step 3. Place the items you are using in the small bronze or silver pots, and then place the pots on the large metal tray. Step 4. Bathe and put on clean clothes before entering the shrine to maintain the space's sanctity. During their menstrual cycles, women customarily don't partake in a puja. Step 5. Enter the shrine with your family. The holiest time for puja is considered to be just before sunrise. Step 6. Use ghee to light the standing and smaller lamps. The standing one usually stays on all day. Step 7. Light incense with a burner or a matchstick. Step 8. Express your devotion to the murti of your selected deity or deities. The images allow direct communication between participants and the deities. Hindus do not worship the murti themselves, they worship God, who is present in the images. Step 9. Place the murti in a deep tray and bathe them with sacred water or milk. Sacred water and milk can be found in stores specialising in Hindu worship items. Step 10. Remove the tray used to catch the sacred water or milk. Step 11. Dry the murti and dress them in colourful clothing. Step 12. Recite prayers and passages from scriptures such as the Vedas. Step 13. If you are using them, smear powder, paste or ash on the murti. The puja leader can also smear these on devotees' foreheads as blessings. Step 14. Make other offerings such as rice, fruit or flowers. Distribute food and flowers to devotees. Step 15. Play a song for the deities. This could be a popular recording of a hymn, known as bhajan, or a family member can sing. It all depends on the type of puja. Step 16. End the puja with arti. Wave the lamps or a tray of lamps in front of the murti in a circular clockwise motion to represent the cyclical nature of creation. Arti is often accompanied by the ringing of bells. Did you know? During a car puja, new wheels are blessed.